the most critical part is how do we secure our assets. I think uh, there were studies that were, were shared today that talked about how to expose the openness of our lines, uh, lack of fencing, and so on. Uh, uh, we have to recover the real business part because of it's almost 60% of trust. Your metro rail, where it has your MLPS, and so on. So we have a, what we call a focus-based recovery approach, which I'll share. Uh, the effort is to increase our reliability, predictability, uh, safety, and so on. And then uh, through this, we have to spend our our allocations. Last year already, we spent at least about 12.5 billion of our capex. Hence, you now starting to see the trains coming. We are given close to about 17.5 billion that we have to reinvest in the rail to recover it and so on. So we have to have a program that responds and the market that responds to this uh, challenge that face us. Obviously, at the end, we want to grow patronage because rail, as I said, we are a mass, mass mover. We depend on higher volumes. So it's important that we look at the aspect of a, a, a patronage. Simplified our value chain. And hence, I said, we are focused on rebuilding the inbound logistics. That's your heavy infrastructure, your payway, the overhead, the rolling stock, the workplaces, the ISEMs part of it. Because if you don't build this lake, you will not be able to deal with issues of cost coverage. Obviously, after you rebuild your inbound, you are able to operate and obviously provide a reliable service. Uh, in terms of what we wanted to achieve, in terms of recovery, obviously, recover every step of our value chain, from a passenger pre, uh, planning the trip, being inside of the train, ultimately outside of the train. And you'll see that that's where the critical infrastructure come about, where we are really focused on. At the center of the station, where a train comes, signaling system, payway, uh, your OHTE tractions, your ticketing systems, your intermodal aspect, and also issues of the timetable. Now, the goal of the rebuilding, as I said, I'm more sharing than a study of where we are. We are, there are three aspects that we wanted to look at to rebuild the total system. As you see it from, from uh, the legal requirement, the legislative requirement, the value chain, the customer aspect, and the, where everything integrates. So we want to rebuild the total system. And as per the corridor, I'll share the corridors that we are having. Um, and also, uh, we want to respond to the issues around the customers. Critical issues that uh, we have an uh, agreement with the customers Simplified, we have to provide a reliable, available, predictive, safe, and secure environment for passengers to, 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 to really enjoy our system. Guarantee on-time performance, uh, reduce the number of cancellations, and ensure that whoever comes into our space feels secured. You can bring your laptop, all the items that you require. So that's how we are, we are effecting the rebuilding.